Welcome back to Surviving in Alabama. I did a uh, short earlier this morning. Are they going to make it? Go check that out. That's just where I just showed the babies. So, this rabbit mama's just not doing well. I, I don't know if she's going to, like, if she has another litter, if, if she will take up the motherly instincts and take care of her babies, but... We're losing babies. I, we lost one this morning. Um, and there's another, let's see. Before we get to this video, before I show you anything, please like, share, and subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. I'm going way above and beyond trying to show y'all as best content as I can. I know I'm probably not the best YouTuber. I know that. I'm not the best homesteader. I know that, but I'm doing, I'm trying really hard to give y'all good content something to think about and showing y'all what i'm doing and hit that subscribe button let's go so we started out with 11 and let's see here's one two three four five six left and she is not she is not taking care of these babies She's just not doing it. And I'm not sure that any of them are survived. Which is sad because 11 babies, that's a good litter. Now, I do have another. Hang on. Now, I, I don't know why i'm i am not a rabbit expert even though we've had rabbits before but they were always just I, we just had a few pet rabbits just because my kids liked them these are the first meat rabbits we, we ever had and this these right here this is what i've got and then i got another pen over there it's got a, a couple in it let me show you this mama right here let's see this mama right here <laughs> she's She's losing, losing her winter coat, so she's just shedding real bad. But she's my, she's the best mama I have. Now she has, I think she had maybe eight or nine. I can't remember. She had eight or nine her last litter, but her first litter, her first litter, she did not take care of. And so I was like, okay. So after watching some videos about it. So after watching videos and talking to people about it, and I actually emailed, um, let me get over here where I can talk. So after, after uh, watching some videos and emailing um, another YouTuber who, who I don't know, but I emailed Andrea over at VW Family Farms. If you don't know them, go check them out. Uh, I watch their stuff. I can't watch it all the time because, hey, I'm out here shooting videos too. I just can't watch everybody. But um, anyway, so uh, talking with other people, emailing her and watching other people's videos, and they said from the best that I knew that could tell that if they don't take up the motherly instinct, you got to give them another try or two. And if by three letters... They don't do it. She's got to go. So let me go back and show you. So this mama right here, who is the mother of these and this one, but this mother right here, her first litter, she, she didn't do it. She didn't, wouldn't take care of them. But the second litter she did. And then she, since then she's had three litters and she's, um, she's had three litters total. And she has done the last two litters. She's done a fantastic job. And she's super protective. If you try to get in there with, uh, if you put your hands in there with the baby, she's coming. She don't attack you or anything, but she's, she is protective. And so she, she, she takes real good care of them. So these two are two males and I've got to get them out on some grass. I've been intended on making a rabbit tractor <clears throat> and I just hadn't hadn't had time but it, it's coming uh, I need them to get a little bit bigger before they become a fryer uh, just for y'all that who are new to the channel uh, this is rusty and the reason I call him rusty is because 
I made his feeder out of a coffee can and it rusted up and he rubs on it all the time. So he's got rust on his fur. See his rust on him. And this is Larry. This is Larry the Cable Rabbit. See his nose is messed up? It's because he sticks his nose over here with Rusty and Rusty will bite it. So he's got a cleft nose or a split nose or anyway. I mean, he's fine, but it's, he's a little deformed now because he wouldn't, he, he wouldn't stop sticking his nose over there. Now, this mama right here, she's another good mama, but she doesn't have big litters. Uh, she's had two litters, and she's taken care of both of them. She's done a good job. But she, I think she had three one time and four the next. So her, she's having very small litters, but she's still a good mama, and I'm not going to get rid of her or anything because, you know, I, I, I want them to take care of them. That's very important. And this meat rabbit right here is a female that my daughter has taken up to be a pet. And she called it Angel, Angel Bunny. So anyway, she she loves petting the rabbits and talked me into keeping one. So that's she's not going to be a fryer. I, I'm going to try to have to find somebody to breed her. I'll have to backtrack how she got bred so I don't, so I don't have any inbreeding. But going back to this one, this is the mother at hand while we're talking. She is just not doing well. And so this is her second litter that she did not take care of. And so from what everybody says, I got to give her another time. So I'm going to give her one more time. And if she doesn't, she doesn't do it, then she's going to have to become a fryer. So, and I hate that because she's a grown, she's a good big size rabbit and she's having giant litters she's just not taking care of them and i don't know if there's anything i can do about it so i did see uh, i did see uh, uh, one of them nurse i mean i saw that but she it's like she's she's not keeping them warm and then she, when she jumps up in there to the in the in the nest with them she's stomping them and stuff it's just she's just not 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 good right now that's just a quick update on the rabbits. Uh, just some really sad news for the homestead because, you know, it, 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 it's sad. It's sad because, you know, we don't ever want to lose an animal on the homestead that is not intended to lose it at that time because we, we do uh, want them to fulfill their purpose. And uh, we were... God made us ruler over the over the earth and the animals, and and I'm trying real hard to be a good steward about that and give them the best life that I can and I can possibly uh, give them. And then <clears throat> at the time that they that that the day comes that that we're to eat them or whatever, I want them to have a good day up until then. And so anytime uh, we lose any that's premature, that's a sad day, and that that's not being a good steward for what we've been given. So I'm really trying to do that and uh, losing a litter, which they're all not, you, you saw, I just showed it to you. We have six left, started with 11. So, and I'm not gonna show that to y'all. What? So I've got to go get rid of those. But um, anyway, we don't want any predators around. Anyway, come back tomorrow. Like, share, and subscribe. God bless.